So my thermostat controlled relay has just has just arrived and I'm gonna hook it up and see what happens. And ta-da! Okay. Uh, so it's flickering really badly on the screen, but uh, in real life you can't see that. In the situation where I'm using it, I want it to be um, turning on at 30 degrees, but for the sake of this example, I'll tell it to turn on at 20 and then turn off. at 18. If I warm that up by holding it in my hot little fingers, it should turn on. Uh, am I hot enough? Let's give it a good... There we go. You can do it. Ah, here we go. So, it turned on the relay, and if this is in the battery, then all of a sudden the fan starts, and then if we let it go down, I wonder how quickly it loses temp. Here we go. It's down to 18. Eventually, then the fan will turn off. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Yeah. All right. So that's basically the the behaviour I want. I want the fan to turn on uh, when it. I have this set to thirty, maybe thirty or forty. I haven't decided yet. Um, have this turn on at say forty and turn off at thirty-eight. So, what I want is 24 volts in, then another 24 volts going through the relay and out to the fans. And another 24 volts going off to the LEDs. Okay, here's what we have. Uh, 24 volts coming in. That goes off to the LEDs. 20 volts, 4 volts coming in. Um, converted down to 12 volts, which goes into the thermometer control relay. And runs that. Then, we also have, from the 24 volts, going off to the relay, which switches the plus side of the 24 volts off and on, and the rest of it, the negative, and then the 24 volts through the relay, goes off to this daughter board, and the three fans plug into that, and they are, let's see if I can focus on that, Yes, it will. They are just soldered in series.
All right, thermal control in and running. I'm not quite sure how effective it is yet. Next step is a whole bunch of monitoring um, and load testing. So we'll see how that goes. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Cheers.